Since this one doesn't have any good evidence, let's just believe their claim and come up with an alternative explanation for that claim. Remember, alternative explanations do not dispute the evidence, or in this case, the claim, or say it was due to coincidence. So, we have to assume that verbal advantage users do actually end up making more money. What possible explanations could we look at here? I would be inclined to use a groups are not equal to begin with explanation. For example, an alternative explanation would be that the people who self-select into the verbal advantage group by buying the product are doing anything they can to earn more money. As such, we can't tell if it's verbal advantage or something else that helped them earn more money. There are lots of other possibilities here, so feel free to be creative.